Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be sharing with you guys the Lollipop Box Club kit for January. I'm so excited. I love receiving my Lollipop Box Club kits and there's always so much that you can do with them. They're super fun. They're very versatile. You can use them for your planner setups. You can use them for snail mail, for embellishments. So, here it is. I already opened the box um, because, well, one, I usually like to take my Instagram pictures on Sundays because that's when I have, like, really good lighting and I'm home most of the day, so I have time to take my pictures. So I did take a few pictures already. Um, but this is the box for this month. It's called Follow Your Heart. And we have had this theme before, but this is, like, a different um, design. She did different, like... Um, paper colors, different um, uh, art, and all that stuff. So here is the postcard. It says, follow your heart. And you can use this for just about anything. You can use it as a dashboard, punch little holes. You can use it as an insert, uh, maybe laminated if you want to use it in a traveler's notebook or something. You can use it to decorate like the cover of a book. Um, here is the paper clip. And this right here is actually the planner kit. So you get all of these four items. You get the inserts, and this is for an A5 ring planner. You get a paper clip, you get some planner stickers, and you get the little postcard. So you get that. Here are the planner stickers. And this is for the month of February, which is awesome. So even though you get the box in January, you're all set up and ready for February. Um, so here that is. Look at the numbers. I love the colors with the blues and the pinks and the reds. And then here is the super cute paper clip. That's what that looks like. And you don't, um, you don't have to throw these out. You can definitely use the tags. I like to use mine for like templates um, in case I want to use and make my tags. And then here we have the in, uh, planner kit. The insert. So this is what they look like. So you get a seven day view on one page and then you get a weekly view on two pages. And then you also get like little check boxes so you can make like little lists in case you need to buy something or um, make certain appointments. And then you have AM PM check off list. And then in the back you get the notes. So that's um, pretty much how you get it as you can see. And this is all set up and ready for the month of February. And it is undated, which is pretty cool. Right now, I'm kind of just saving mine for when I'm ready to get back into an A5 ring planner. Um, so I do love that it is um, undated. Now, as for the stickers go, um, I definitely try to use the sticker sheet of my planner. That way, I can use up the numbers and the February, although there's no 2019 or it's no 2020. It's not dated officially, so that's a bonus. And then here is the kit itself. So here's another postcard, um, and this one's actually different. How cute is that? Oh, I love that. So two different ones. All right, so then once you open it up, you got the tissue paper, love the blue, <laughs> love the hearts. And here you get the newsletter, and this gives you a lot of fun um, ideas, a lot of fun information. Um, you can cut out, here you get an oatmeal and raisin cookie recipe get organized. Um, I like to cut these out and you can laminate them and use them in your planners, decorative pieces. Um, the word of the year is push and I know she was looking for a word of the year and I guess she finally decided on one. And then here's a creative challenge and then a new and exclusive look at the um, kit in class. And here's a sneak peek for the month of February kit and it is Daydreamer. Oh my god, I love that. That is so cute. I can't wait. And it already looks like it's going to be so cute. I love that. So you can definitely get a lot of good ideas out of this. If you guys haven't yet, go check out Lisa's YouTube channel. She has a lot of fun ideas. Um, I love to watch her for like journaling inspiration because that's pretty much what she kind of focuses on and planning as well. So super awesome. And then you also get a pen in the kit. How cool. It's a gray. And then you get some stickers. These are just like little circle stickers. I love this one. You get the candy. You usually get a lollipop, but this time she sent a piece of candy. And I always like to eat it after my unboxing. And then here's a little 
bonus secret goodie bag. And if you don't tear up the um, bags, you can definitely use them as like little pockets in your um, traveler's notebook or in your planner or with your dividers. And look at how cute this is. So you get a ribbon with some little hearts. You get some wood veneers. Love those. You get a blue tag, super cute. And then you get the pull apart cards. And then you get a little um, eyelet, I think there was only one. And then like the little heart shakes. And then you get some little bling, super cute. And then I'm guessing these are the die cuts. I always look forward to these, I love die cuts. Look at how cute this is. Oh my goodness, these are beautiful. I love the color. So cute. I love when she gets the words. I love the little arrows. Then you got little notes that you can write with. Super, super cute. I don't know how I'm going to use this kit yet. I'm still kind of thinking. <laughs> so my tutorial Tuesday video will most likely be up late tomorrow because I have no idea what I want to do yet. And then here are the wooden veneers and you get some little staples. And then in here, you get, I forgot what she called these. There's a name for them, but it's kind of like a, like a button but without the, the backing. So you can like hot glue this onto any project, so that's super cute. And here you have a little um, crochet heart. You can always turn this into a paper clip. And then here you have a little follow your heart stamp. Super cute. And then here you have another sticker sheet. I love the pencil, love the banners, love the scalloped border, love the arrow, love the words. <laughs> so cute. And then, oh my gosh, I was so excited about this one. Things to do, to-do list. Lisa is very big on to-do lists, so um, I'm guessing that's why she always gets inspired to do a little to-do notepad um, because she's always doing to-do lists to get her through her day, and I just, I love that. It's a great way to stay organized. Um, so, like, for example, it's, like, Monday, and let's say you want to throw out the trash, do the dishes. It's a good way to just check something off because for me, definitely, whenever I check something off my list, I feel accomplished. I feel um, uh, active. I feel like I'm basically on top of the world. <laughs> so this one's super fun. I love the size. I love the color. It has a little to-do list, the urgent, things you need to get done like ASAP. Um, if I have extra seconds and notes so very cute and you get a large amount i love that all right so then the one that i always look forward to of course is the paper because the paper is usually what inspires me um i love this bag by the way super cute super blue and she usually does always send these little um weekly um sheets so you can write down like Things you need to do. I've been collecting these as well. Um, I haven't really been using them because I eventually would like to use them in some way. Um, and then you get the February calendar all in one. Usually like to put this on my refrigerator or I clip it in my planner area somewhere just so that I can see the dates. And then here's the paper. You usually get two sets of each. <laughs> Look at how cute this is, it's like a soft pink that goes into a red, almost like an ombre with pink polka dots, super cute. And then you get the solid blue, which I love, you guys know blue is my favorite color. This one with the heart, so adorable. And then here we have this one with the black and gray arrows. And then there's this one with the multiple colors and it's just some kind of artwork. And I think she actually designs the artwork herself, which is amazing. She's super talented. Um, so if, yeah, if you guys haven't checked out Lisa, definitely go check her out on her Instagram, on her YouTube channel, on her website. She does have a blog as well. And usually whenever I do my projects, she does post my projects on her blog, which I love to check out. 
And yeah, that's pretty much it, you guys. That is the kit for the month of January. I absolutely love it, and I can't wait to start playing around with it. Like I said, I'm still trying to figure out what I want to do in... I don't want to just like do anything. I don't like to rush into my project. So I'm going to think about it a little bit, you know, maybe get some chores done and stuff. And I have a long day of work tomorrow. So um, my video might be up kind of late, but it'll be up nonetheless. Um, that's pretty much it, you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. I hope you guys enjoy it. I will have all the links for the lollipop box club linked down below for you guys to check out i also have a coupon code and um i have a coupon code on my instagram as well um i hope you guys enjoyed today's video thank you guys so much for watching as always give it a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it don't forget to hit that subscribe button i love you guys and i'll see you guys on the next one bye